Okay, Alhamra Palace now. Let's start trading and to grasp some uh, ideas about a very interesting text. As you see in the picture, this is the uh, Alhamra Palace in Spain, and we will know some information about uh, this place. Alhambra Palace is, uh, or in Granada, is part of the impressive heritage of the long-lasting Islamic Empire in Spain. Uh, so where is Alhambra Palace located? Excellent. It is in Granada, like Granada, a part, a huge part of the impressive uh, Islamic heritage, Spain. Uh, Andalusia, yes. Uh, and now he start to explain the name of the uh, Alhamra Palace. He says its name in Arabic Qasr al Hamra. Qasr al Hamra means the red castle. The red castle. This refers to the red coloring of the bricks that the original palace was built from. Then why the palace is red? Because of the bricks, because of the bricks that the original palace was uh, built from. It has become an important tourist attraction in Spain because of, of its rich Islamic history. It has also had a lot of influence on worldwide art and architecture since it was built. So it's a very important destination to go. If you want to go to Spain, uh, the first place that you will be managing to go to is Qasr al-Hamra or Al-Hamra Palace in uh, Granada, in a hill overlooking Granada. Uh, let's continue this second paragraph, which talks about the palace in particular, and um, how beautiful is the view uh, if you go there, if you give the chance to go there. This palace, which was built on a hill overlooking Granada, uh, has beautiful views. The first king arrived in the 13th century and constructed a royal palace. So, talking about the 13th century, 1300, and constructed a royal palace. After that, other kings added more parts to the palace. It is it wasn't built only by one king, one royal family, but it was built by many kings, um, many monarchs added to that uh, palace. So it wasn't only for a group of people, it was for the whole uh, uh, families that came and ruled uh, Spain, Islamic Empire in Spain. Uh, so it's, it was a royal palace. When we say royal palace, that means uh, it's related to the uh, king, the queen, and the family, the royal family that uh, ruled during that time. From the 13th century to the end, of, let's say, of the 14th or 15th century okay this is why it has so many different styles so when we ask this question why the palace uh